72 caliber bullet will lodge in the lung, and we can probably get it out, maybe able to get it, and save the life. A 9 millimeter bullet blows the lung out of the body. You know, that's probably the dumbest thing anybody said to me around here in a long time. It made it harder for people to buy stabilized bra braces. Put a pistol on a brace, it may turns into a gun. My, my, my legislation says there can be no more than eight bullets in a round. That bullet travels five times as fast as something coming out of a muzzle of a gun. Most bullets would go just straight through and out, leaving little, but it blows up once it's inside your body. Who in God's name needs a weapon with a hundred rounds in a chamber? Right here, dude. If you want to protect yourself, get a double barrel shotgun. Have the shells, a 12-gauge shotgun, and I promise you, as I told my wife, we live in an area that's wooded and somewhat secluded. I said, Jill, if there's ever a problem, just walk out on the balcony here, or walk out, put that double-barrel shotgun, and fire two blasts outside the house. I remember when I was campaigning, when I was a senator, going through the, through, through the wetlands of Delaware to meet all the people who were most upset with me, the fishermen and the hunters. And I came across a guy who was fishing, and he said, you want to take my gun? And I looked at him, I said, yeah, I don't want to take your gun. You're allowed to have a gun, but I want to take away your ability to use an assault weapon. And it, well, no, no, here, here, this is how the conversation went. He said, what do you mean I need that gun? I said, guess what? If you need 12 to 100 bullets in a gun, in a magazine, you're the lousiest shot I've ever heard. Great story. Compelling and rich.